hello guys and welcome to a brand new video today i'm here with another ghibli movie and this is only yesterday or the japanese name omoide poro poro um this will be the end of the ghibli movies that i'm reacting to like every week uh i think i've done almost all of them uh, i've like skipped only the ones which are extremely low rated like uh, 6 and 6.5 something like that so like all of the others uh, i've done and this will be the final one that i'm doing of the ghibli movies uh, it has been i think three or four months that i'm doing th this weekly and i have to say like it has been an amazing experience uh, i've like i've like started loving the ghibli movies and uh, i i don't know like do the ghibli movies i mean do they still do these movies or have they stopped uh studio ghibli like i saw like uh the what do you call it the most recent one was most probably in 2014 i think uh which was omoide no marni after that did they do any other show like, anyways like i think like uh i'm not sure if they still uh, they're still doing uh like movies or they have stopped doing them but if they keep you know if they do more movies i will definitely like react to them because like it has been an amazing experience and like most of the movies that i have watched were so good like uh, like each and every department the animation department the soundtrack department the story department it was something completely else and uh, like i loved it okay i'm going to talk about all of this after the movie ends you know when like in the discussion portion so like i have a lot to talk about so yeah and for the record uh like i'm saying like what i'm going to do th the next week i'll be starting the other movies which i have not watched uh, i'll be doing akira and uh like like that like i'll do uh, weekly every movie that i've not watched and if you guys have any kind of suggestions uh like i'll do like i'll try to do most of the movies most of the anime movies but if you still like you know have any suggestions you can just suggest me in the comments and i'll do them before the others you know like i'll give it a priority so like you can do that like right in the comment section so yeah anyway so let's get started with this movie and uh, this is uh, omoide poro poro or only yesterday so i'll be putting the subtitles and the timer here sync it to whichever is your preference and let's get started all right so here's the countdown three two one go Excuse me. Only yesterday. This show I've seen in my anime list. It has a good rating, but it is not as popular as the Ghibli movies. So, like, let's see what this is about. Based on. Aiwa Hana Kimiwa Sonatan. Oh, these are the songs. This is really you know nice soundtrack like um what can you say like a calm peaceful Okay, okay, so this is in the modern world. All right. The setting. I remember having those keyboards. 
like you know like the completely normal keyboards plain ones nowadays we have these flashy keyboards <laughs> gamer keyboards as they say uh what Wow. Yeah. Huh. Oh no. <laughs> Movie. Hmm. <laughs> She heard it from <laughs> she heard it from her friends and she like wants to go. <laughs> That's a shame. Hmm. <laughs> oh no, yeah. Um, Ata Atami, where is it? Oh, I'm guessing it's like one of the places. Okay, her <laughs> enthusiasm like got so down. Oh. Final what? <laughs> Wait, what? Do they want? Don't want to spend money or something? Oh no, they don't want to go. <laughs> go oh my god, they were just like saying it for the sake of it. I think so. Oh. Two of them only. Hot springs. <laughs> um. Oh, okay. So where are you going? Damn. Taiko? Isn't the little girl's name Taiko? Oh, is this her past or something? I mean, his, uh, her future. Wait, 27 is not young? Oh, for... Okay, okay. That time, okay. That flower? Hmm. Oh no, yeah. 
<laughs> okay. Okay, so this is like going back and forth. Only she and her grandma. <laughs> Damn, so many bots. Oh, this is a Roman bot. Damn, it's huge. Yeah, it's the Roman bot for a reason, you know? Oh my god, she's getting lightheaded because of going into so many bots. That was the trip. Going into different bots. <laughs> Oh, is this how radio calisthenics are done? I've never seen it, you know, like I've always heard about it from anime, obviously. <laughs> okay, yeah, this is her past. She's thinking about it. Pineapple. Uh, actually, I also don't know how pineapples are cut. Like the, this, a uh, proper, like technique, I think. <laughs> She's like, I have a banana. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> okay, let's see how they do it. I myself do not know how. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> I love pineapples, you know, pineapples is like so amazing. Like, it's one of my favorite fruits. Okay, it's quite simple. <laughs> Pineapples are amazing, I have to say. What? It doesn't they doesn't like it? Um, what? Oh no! Wait, but the pineapples I had are quite sweet, but... Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh my god. I, I like pineapple, you know? Like, I don't know what type of pineapple they're having, but... The ones that we have are quite nice. Does she? I don't think she likes it. Yeah, she doesn't like it. <laughs> Oh, she like or oh, not. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it doesn't seem she likes it. Hmm. 
No, Baron's also good. Um... <laughs> Like thinking about it, I don't feel I do not like any fruit. I like like each and every fruit, as far as I can say. Yeah, there's not been a fruit that I do not like. <laughs> Look at her face. <laughs> okay, I think the pineapple is not good. Mangoes. Or okay. But in actuality, I think the king of fruits is a, ma is a mango, isn't it? Oh. Started the rock and roll band, okay. All right. So this is like a reminiscing anime. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> wow. Mm hmm. Okay. She <laughs> didn't eat. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, and she's eating it. <laughs> yeah, he's impressed. Oh. <laughs> you delete <laughs> Wow. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> wow. What? What type of <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Damn, these kids are smart. <laughs> oh no. Oh my god, no one can say anything.
<laughs> All right, that's settled then. Oh, she has more. <laughs> Oh no. Oh oh my god, this this girl is too smart. <laughs> oh no. Ah, okay. Oh the teacher is like, okay, I'm not getting into this. Oh no. <laughs> I hate school food. <laughs> wow. Okay, this is quite fun. This is also making me nostalgic about a lot of things, you know, like my school days and everything. <laughs> Electric pencil sharpener. What? Oh my god, what are, what are they up to? Oh my god! <coughs> um... Um, okay. Okay. Well. Hmm. Oh, so this guy. Damn. I don't think she's like he wrote. Yeah, like obviously. <laughs> wow. Damn. Okay, this is... <laughs> oh yeah, no running! You, you only said that. <laughs> Oh boy. Hmm. 
Okay. <laughs> well, now what? Okay. Wow. Now he won't be able to pitch properly. Or will he? <laughs> oh. Damn. Okay, one. Two more. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh is it out? Okay, they got them. Got them. <laughs> okay, one more. One more, isn't it? Okay, strike again. Okay, the, oh, the, the, they need three strikes. Uh, all right. And there you go, the three strikes. Three strikes. Excuse me. Hmm. <laughs> Damn, the opposing team is also like, what the hell is happening? <laughs> wow. <clears throat> oh, it's over. Hmm. <laughs> Whoa. Damn. <laughs> And there she goes. Hmm. <clears throat> Who is this? What? It's that guy, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Okay, this is awkward.
Okay. Oh, we used to also do this, you know, like throw the ball up in the high in the sky and then catch it while running and everything. Whoa, she started. <laughs> she started walking up. <laughs> okay, that was a little bit surprising. Suddenly. Hmm. Uh. <laughs> Look at her eyes, <laughs> sparkling. Wow. Uh. Hmm. Wow. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, you, you start remembering. You know? <laughs> wow. The way they're narrating the, you know, story is quite nice. Like they are like, like, you know, like bringing the two together, like her younger self and her like older self. <laughs> it's like they're on the same train. Okay. Hmm. Uh. Oh, this is uh the Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. There. Oh great. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. 
<clears throat> nah. <clears throat> oh my god. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, these are like kids. <laughs> These are like, that's kids in a nutshell, you know? Oh no, they're going to like, blame her and everything. Hmm. <clears throat> uh. Oh no, Ever, like they're going to like associate that with okay. E yeah, yeah, I I'm going to say I'm saying that like they're going to associate that with that. And like you know, like they're kids, like they're going to do that. Oh no, and now she's going to feel, you know. Yeah, 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 like this is going to happen. And she'll f feel embarrassed to. Hmm. Oh boy, well, oh no, she's getting a fever, and on top of this, if she does PE, e. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Oh no, this makes it worse. <laughs> oh no, she is now going to like, oh my god. Okay, they, they're like, skipping it. <laughs> yeah, like looking at her, you can see that she's sick. <clears throat> oh. Um, and there you go. Yep. Um, yeah, kids are like this. Ah. Uh, yeah, that that's kids for you. Ah. Uh, she's like, why is this girl laughing? Ah. Uh, oh no, she's. Yeah. Yeah. Well, she's pretty, you know, like calm-headed. Like nothing faces her. 
If that's a good quality. Yeah. yeah that's a good thing, you know. Like when people see that, uh, <clears throat> like after, even after, like you don't know. Okay. As I was saying, like if the kids see that she's not being affected by their, you know, they'll also leave it alone. Texting them pointlessly. Hmm. Okay, she is. She arrived, I'm guessing. Wait, does he know her? Like she, he's looking at her. Or not? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, this guy knows her probably. Or not. Oh, he missed the train. Damn. <laughs> okay, he knows her. One of the one of the kids. Oh, he's here to pick her up. Oh, I was okay. 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 <laughs> um, okay. Um, yeah. O okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, who, like, which thief asks your name and steals stuff? Oh my god. Okay. Ugh. Hmm. Yeah, the car is really small. <clears throat> okay. Hmm. Oh. Um. Okay, there you go.
Hmm, yeah, I was thinking. Oh, okay, Hungarian group. Hmm, okay. Oh. Wow, okay. Damn, this place is nice. It's clearing up, you know, the rain has gone and it's like sunny outside. Wow. You know, there's this thing, like, after it rains, there's this thing, like, we feel, like, it's, like, fresh. Everything is, like, fresh. Like, when the air feels, like, you know, clean and nice. Hmm. What? Oh. oh yeah damn <laughs> mm. yeah Oh. Oh. <laughs> wow. Damn, there's no cars and nothing. Uh. Is the right rice I'm guessing? Like rice fields? Damn. No, he's talking about the plants, I'm guessing. Yeah, he's talking about the plants. Yeah. <laughs> Let me print. Organic farm, okay. Oh no, his. <laughs> Is it making puns or something? I think so. It was lost in translation. Not just that, okay.
Oh, wow. <laughs> oh. Yeah, like after the journey. Did his research. Oh, okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Damn, this place is extremely, you know, uh, like barely any people. But I'm guessing it's because it's uh, like the morning or something, like, you know, very early in the morning. That's why there are like no people. The houses are like wooden houses. Okay, there are people. They're like farming. Okay, so these are safflowers. I've never seen a safflower. Damn, they're, they're like smiling. <laughs> Damn. Okay. What's with this music? It's like a you know, it's like as if they're going to fight some demon lord or something. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow. I think I've seen these flowers, but they're called staff flowers. Or not, or not. I don't know. Oh, so the flower itself is thorny. Oh, damn, that's. Wow. Oh. They like said they approved the you know petals only like that. Like they're not taking the whole flower. Or is is that Okay, this is just like, you know, tearing the flower.
I mean, I think I've... Uh, I have seen these flowers, I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah, or... Damn, the... Wow, this is... You no, know, the art is so good. <clears throat> oh and they're like oh is, it, is this these flowers okay like, and this is how they make dye of it Oxidize and turn red. Okay, okay, okay. And these are like used in dyes. Oh, there's something more. Oh, they're fermenting it. Okay, okay. Long process. Oh. oh, they are like, okay, okay, color it like that. Oh, wow. And then they make patterns on it. Yeah, like they were like drying it, but then, then the, suddenly the rain came in and they have to like put it away now. Damn, they are like again bloomed. <laughs> ah. Hmm. <laughs> okay. New sneakers. Yeah, it's quite pricey. Oh. Damn. <laughs> Is there no copyright? Like, you know, like they're kind of not changing the name. Like usually, you know, in animals, they kind of change the name. Like Pema or something like that. <laughs> you know, like they change the name a little bit. She's remembering her past. <laughs> okay. And she's...
Oh. <laughs> She's not happy about that. <laughs> she is like picking. What are those? Like onions? Ah, yeah, those are onions, I think. Damn. Uh. <laughs> mm. Oh boy. Uh, he's remembering, uh, like you know, the the conversation, like do not waste food and everything. Ah, uh, grandma has spoken. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> she silenced everyone in that place. Um. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, damn. <laughs> yeah, she's angry. Well, you can't blame her. <laughs> well, that's siblings. What's the matter? Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh. Um. Come on, go! Like you missed your chance. Uh. You want someone to say that, come. Like, I get it. Like, <laughs> there was some... Like, this is like... You know? The stubbornness that kids have. Uh, yep. Uh. I I'm guessing they're like waiting for her. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. Ah. Uh. 
Yeah. Oh no. Okay. Oh boy, well... Oh! I feel I must have been adopted. <laughs> wow. Yeah, but only one time, you know. Yeah, like I, I was also thinking, like, just like because you came out without wearing your shoes, just for that. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hmm. What are the pickles? Yeah. Ha! <laughs> oh, what's that? Wow, so many cars at the same time. What the? Hmm. <laughs> Actions. <laughs> Yeah, that was quite easy. You don't have to reverse them. I'm guessing she was bad at it. What? No, that is not. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, she's thinking that's so is that why I'm Oh. 
Oh, oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> um, excuses. So, blow picture. <laughs> What's the blow picture? Oh, you blow on it? What? Okay. Wow! <laughs> Damn, that's a solid excuse. Like, like I have no way to refute that. <laughs> yeah, what will be the correct answers? Tell me. Oh no, she doesn't. All right, okay. Yep, saw that coming. Oh, okay, what did she do? Do she didn't even like inverse it. <laughs> Um, <laughs> oh no, <laughs> I'm honest. Yeah, I go and ask. Yeah, I go. Oh no, she's going to. Oh. oh my god <laughs> she's like the whole world has fallen on her head <laughs> oh boy <laughs> is she all right in the head Oh my god. Uh, uh. Uh. That's awkward. Ah. Uh. <laughs> yeah, just flip it. I also, oh boy, yeah, yeah, yeah. Spreading a fraction by fraction. Well, Yeah, but what? Yeah, it will reduce. Damn, <laughs> you forget about apples, like, 
Just do your numbers. <laughs> they have apples. <laughs> wow. Damn. Just barely. <sighs> um. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> oh my god, these guys. Oh no. Yeah, like No. <laughs> Just thinking too much into it, you know, that was that's the problem. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. That's good enough. Um, no. Oh, damn. Hmm. Okay, don't fall from that place. Like, he's like moving too much. <laughs> no way. Interesting point. Okay. Oh, wow. Damn. Okay. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah.
But thinking about it like that, then everything is man-made, isn't it? Like, that's not true, but yeah, you can kind of think it like that. Yeah, like I was saying, like, like it, the world has the foundation. Farmers can't exist without nature. <laughs> What's so great about organic farming? <laughs> Only the theory. Okay, well, What? <laughs> okay. Oh, all right. Village child A. Well, at least she's not tree A. You know, like, like I I had to once act as a tree. You know, in front in a school play, not a tree, a corn. I had to play as a corn. You know? Huh. Wow. <laughs> At least she was a villager. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sports version of villager. <laughs> What? Yeah, like... Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh 
Oh. Okay. <laughs> the teacher say what? What is this? Oh, I don't know. She's going to say like, why are you adding? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's acting. Okay, that's the acting part. Um, okay, that's better, you know? Like, he, she did not say any extra words. Will a child A was a hit? <laughs> oh, okay. Damn. <laughs> Will a child A become the main protagonist? <laughs> oh, something better happened. <laughs> Wait, did she get scouted or something? Oh yeah, she kind of got scouted. <laughs> like I'll become a star. Yeah, her mom's like... Damn! <laughs> Wow, she's having a complete, <laughs> like, you know, fantasy. <laughs> hmm. Well, what did her mom say? Did she, like, turn him down? Oh, okay. Oh. So... Okay, so she said yes. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's the question. Uh, oh, yeah, that's permission. Okay. Oh, yeah, there you go. <clears throat> uh, 
Yeah. And there you go. Hmm. <clears throat> well, this is happening in the older days, you know, so like people had this kind of uh, like, you know, this kind of a thing. Hmm, it's refusing. Oh boy. <clears throat> hmm. Hmm. Yeah, that's like you have to keep in mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Yeah. Well, Oh, wow. But then what? Like, was she able to do it properly? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah.
Yeah, definitely. Oh, this is some kind of like childhood show, I'm guessing, cartoon. What's with that? Huh. Yeah, what's with this? <laughs> like it. <laughs> Okay, you can also see it in that way, that's true. <clears throat> okay, so... Hmm. Hmm. Uh, yep, I was, I was like, expecting this. Yep, I saw this coming, yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> well um well that's not the problem Well, that's not the problem. Uh, like, uh, yeah, this is awkward. Oh my god, come on, drop it, guys. Uh, yeah, like, what was that about, like? Oh, god damn. Well, you guys are also at fault, like, you're like, continuing that conversation.
Well, that's awkward. No, but like, you know, reality is not as easy. Yeah, like she's like saying it in the perspective of like, yeah, we're spending a few days. It's so good. Yeah, I'll, I'll talk about this later on. Like, this is one thing that we, like, all of us have. Like, all of us kind of feel. Like, it's so good in the countryside, but, like, you know, the modern facilities and everything. Like, what? Hmm. Okay, move, move. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, but in front of the others, he like acted like I don't have any problem. Hmm. <sighs> Yeah. 
Yeah. Oh, that's when, like he said, I want to shake hands with you. But for... Yeah. Yeah, same thing like repeated. Like he she was acting as if like, yeah, everything's so good here, but but this is something like everyone does. Like, Without exception, like everyone has this mask that you have to wear in front of others. You not you cannot show your real feelings. <laughs> he she just got reminded of that. Okay. <laughs> well that's how you, like kids show their affection in a weird way <laughs> hmm He must have felt he must have felt embarrassed, I think. Yeah, like he felt embarrassed. <laughs> Whoa. Well, I also understand, you know? I also understand what he's trying to say. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Acting tough. <sighs> Come on.
No, oh, these are like uh, fireflies. Fireflies, aren't they? Or was it sparkling? Oh no, it, I think it was like sparkling for the like the light of the car. Okay. So it's time to go? Yeah. <laughs> I'll leave the ten year old me. <laughs> okay. What the oh <laughs> damn.
Oh, wow. Okay, that's the end, kind of, we're still, like, it's still ongoing, but, yeah. Oh, wow. Like, you know what this movie is about? This movie is about when you grow up. And you start remembering about all the embarrassing stuff you did as you, as a child. The cringy stuff you did. <laughs> the weird stuff you did. Like, this is the movie. And, like, you kind of acknowledge the fact that, yeah, I was cringy when I was a kid. I was, like, it was embarrassing. I did so many embarrassing stuff. But at the same time, you kind of, like, you know, is nostalgic about that stuff. And like, like, you know, it uh, brings a smile to your face, thinking about those uh, situations and all. <laughs> look, look at the kid. <laughs> oh, I missed the train. <laughs> but then his friends, like, uh, got him in. Okay. Yeah, this is that movie. Uh, a few things I could relate to, you know, uh, not a few things, a lot of things I could relate to. Like stuff that I did uh, as a child and all. And, you know, in my school days and everything. The, you know, the group of friends we had, we used to mess around and all. And stuff, you know, different stuff. And obviously, I am not at an age where I, like, you know, when I can say, like, yeah, I'm, like, reminiscing about these things, about the nostalgic thing. Like, I'm not that old. So, <laughs> like, yeah, it's still kind of, like, uh, like, nostalgic in a few ways. And I'm guessing if I watch this movie after, you know, 10 more years, I'll be able to relate to it even more. And I'll be able to, like... Like the way that she was feeling nostalgic and all, that would be even more. Yeah. Damn! Ha! Okay, so she went back and like, again came back later on. <laughs> Damn, the, the, what is it called? Ayaigasa. Isn't it? The thing that they do in the notebooks and all. Ai ai gasa. <laughs> that like umbrella thing and like two names are written underneath it. Well, there you go. She left her 10 year old self back and is now visiting that place on her own. As she said she would do. Okay, yeah, that's the end. So, like, yeah, as I was saying, like, this is like a film, uh, a movie which kind of, like, you know, like, I have to say one thing, like, I think this is the most normal, you know, a normal and most size of lifey movie I have ever seen in an anime, ever. I have to say this because, like, for a few things, like, they showed us each and everything. Like usually in when like you know when like uh, they like uh, you know get into a car or something like even in slice of life animes like when you get into a car they kind of like uh, time skip it and like skip past that portion and uh, show okay that's the end and show us the uh, like you know when like you get into a car and like sit down and after like a few seconds you see that they have reached the destination uh, not a few seconds but a few minutes you see that they've reached the destination and that's it but this movie kind of showed us the entire, like, everything in a normal pace. Like, you know, you get into a car, you sit down, you put on your seatbelts, 
and then like the person beside you who is driving the car like oh like you know starts the car and starts moving and then you have little bits and pieces of conversation and like uh, like you know you laugh and talk and uh, like while like while the scenery changes uh, beside you and uh, then like after five or six minutes uh, after the whole uh, uh, trip uh, inside the uh, in the car uh, like you get to a destination then you like come out like like i was extremely like you know like it's quite unique the way they did it like this like this is the most normal normal in the sense of most like you know like uh, like this is real life this is how it happens actually like that is uh, what this movie is about this movie is about real life and like it showed us like it put us in the shoes of a person of a lady uh, who is in her 27 year i think 27 years old she was uh, and her kind of going back to this um like countryside where she herself doesn't even know why she gets to remind her own childhood whenever she comes to a place like this and like uh, like same thing happened nostalgia hit her and she started to remember a lot of stuff from her childhood and uh, like it kind of like uh, was like showing us how uh, her child self had like acted in that moment and then how her like now like present self is like thinking about it and like kind of laughing and like getting nostalgic and everything and it was good i have to say and i think like i get it why this is not as famous as the ghibli movies because obviously you don't have any magical like you know magical dragons like flying around or any uh, like <laughs> like you know any big like big uh, mystical creatures or like flying castles nothing is in this show this is just a normal show and that's why i think a lot of people usually do not watch it and the pop the lack of popularity is not because this is you know like mediocre this is a definitely a good show like a good uh, movie but i think the lack of popularity is because people usually usually do not watch this type of stuff so like if someone watches this they will definitely enjoy it and yeah that is what i think so like i was thinking why is this not as popular as the other ghibli movies so i kind of got the reason why and this is more like you know like if i was uh what can i say like um, if i was uh, uh 13 or 12 uh, like a uh, 14 or 15 year old child hmm, who has like you know who watches anime and at that age if i thought that oh let me just watch this ghibli movie and if i started to watch this show uh what is this called only yesterday or omoide poro poro yeah if i started this anime uh, like you know movie i think i would not enjoy myself because I think this, like especially this movie, is for a particular age set, you know, a particular age, uh, like people who are below that age will not enjoy this movie as like uh, the per people in that age, uh, like age range will do. Like for example, my age and uh, like a lot of you guys are like, you know, like uh, who are like teenagers or like a little older than like who has been like you know who are like in the 20s or something like 2021s uh, they will definitely like uh, be able to relate to this a lot more and will enjoy this a lot more so yeah like this is like for a set amount of audiences because obviously if i am myself i'm a kid and if i'm watching this how the hell i will be able to enjoy this you know because this is a, like you are in a shoes of a character who is 27 years old, who is looking at her childhood and reminiscing about it and feeling nostalgic about it. So if you yourself is a, you know, are a child, then you will not get that feeling because you yourself are a child. Like you are doing those stuff now, which are being shown. So obviously the amount like, I'm not saying that you won't enjoy it, but you won't be able to get the same feeling that like a particular age uh, range of people would get watching this show. So I think because of that reason, this is not as popular, but it is a definitely a good show and it kind of like, you know, like showed us how um, like pretty normal stuff, like nothing much to talk about this. Like uh, one thing I can like, you know, like discuss about this show is the whole thing in the end where like she said that um, like I was kind of like I was thinking at that moment when they were asking her that do you like it here and everything. 
uh, and she was like yeah this place is so good like i even like this place even more than tokyo like like in tokyo there's like so many like you know uh stuff but here it's like calm and peaceful and everything and then they suddenly said that so okay like they they mul like in like multiple times they asked that do you like it here do you like it here in a, a lot of ways and then they started saying that okay so if you really like it here why don't you stay here with uh, toshio you know marry him and that's when the awkwardness set in now the awkwardness here set in because of two reasons the first reason here uh, why the awkwardness set in is the way uh, the family members were kind of pushing the whole thing of like oh like you like it here so why don't you like you know settle down here like uh, like you can marry toshio i think that is extremely awkward because obviously like her liking the place does not equate to yeah i'll stay here forever you know like that's not how it works but they were kind of pushing the whole thing and i kind of get it why because obviously they themselves are kind of like you know like seeing that the population here is reducing no one comes here and this is unpopular there's no one here to you know like stay and tosho himself is single and all of these kind of factors so they were a little bit desperate in that moment and <clears throat> but that's going to make someone awkward you know the person especially the person who they are telling these stuff to uh, which is the uh, like uh, 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 what was her name now though now uh, i forgot her name what the hell oh great uh, this is my problem i forgot forget names anyways so yeah like um so yeah that made it extremely awkward that was the first thing that made this whole situation awkward the second thing is that like when they said that okay so why don't you stay here if it is so good over here she understood at that moment that like yeah i was not speaking for my like you know like uh, like like i was acting as if like everything is so good here but in my heart i also know that this place has its problems that's why like you know like uh, but as she said that she was trying to act nice to the others she was like acting as if like everything is so good here whereas in like in truth this place has its fair share share of problems you know because tokyo like in tokyo the things that you will get uh, so easily and like the opportunities and so many things like it's like heaven and hell difference from a countryside which uh, like it's true you know but she was acting as if like everything is so like good over here like whenever like she was like like acting in a way that felt as if like yeah this place is like the uh, heaven on earth so well, like nothing will be the problem if i stay here and she was acting like that uh she was like only kind of cherry picking the good things and like saying that yeah this place is so good whereas this player or place also has its fair share of problems and when this like brought out the fact uh, like you know like brought that into light and said that okay so if it is so good here why don't you stay here it suddenly struck her and she like you know like understood that yeah like the thing that i was doing was quite ins unsincere like i was like acting like trying to act nice in front of these people whereas like you know like uh, when they said that why don't you stay here she did not you know properly like uh, like that uh, like suggestion in a way like she was hesitant about it and like these are the two factors like uh, like she herself was quite pressured about how they were like pressuring her like not pressuring but they were kind of relentlessly saying that okay so why don't you stay here stay here and the the uh, i think it was the dad wasn't it he was like he was really uh, like acting weird he was like saying that okay like why don't why are you like telling these kind of things to her like you're making her embarrassed you're making her awkward but it doesn't mean that i am not <laughs> like you know he he's saying like this like don't make her awkward but at the same time uh, i also feel that yeah like that's a good suggestion you know he was kind of acting like that like f first he was kind of like agreeing to the factor that yeah they are making her embarrassed but at the next moment she he himself was saying that but it will still be good you know if you consider this thing i'm not like he's <laughs> and then you said that i'm not saying that like you have to do it uh, like you're making her awkward don't uh, like ask her like that but it would be good if you like consider the situation that's even more awkward you know the way he was doing it and like the whole conversation felt so weird My, i myself was getting like you know extremely awkward 
and <laughs> like how they were kind of like pushing the whole thing uh, onto her and that's why like she kind of ran away and like she feels as if like everything like th at least that thing was her fault because as you know she herself has a thing from the past where she acted in the same similar way to towards a boy who he felt like that boy was you know dirty the boy was unclean unhygienic she did not like sitting beside him and like uh, throughout the whole term she thought that oh my god like when will this term end when will uh, <clears throat> the seats change and she was thinking it all in her mind but at the same time when the other girls kind of were vocal about that factor she acted nice about it she acted as if like she was like you know taking the moral high ground and said that no like why are you doing saying this to him like uh, like like it's uh, like you know like it's i feel bad for him whereas at the same time she herself thought about it in like in the heart and she like now standing here she felt embarrassed about that situation how she acted and she also felt embarrassed about the situation that she is repeating the same thing like for these guys like as she was saying that yeah this place is so good like like nothing is any, going to be any problem here like it is also like so much better than tokyo like it's the same thing she was doing she was acting nice and like i have to say like everyone does this you know like for like in front of others like everyone does this everyone kind of acts like tries to act nice and uh, but there are a few people who are a little bit too much you know like do this a little bit too much and there is a few people who does not do this like the people who does not actually do this does not try to act nice people call them loners or people call them like they're not like good they're delinquents stuff like that like it's like a social thing like whenever someone is like extremely what can you say casual about stuff does not try to act in a certain way does not act nice in front of others like they does not wear a mask in front of others they're called in that way they're stated in that way that oh this guy he's a loner you know uh, like he has no friends uh, oh this guy he is like uh, like you know uh, quite bad mouthed like he is <clears throat> like you know he uh, like is quite uh, like rude and stuff like that they're uh, like you know kind of uh, it's kind of said like that and people who are too much into this like who I, I like act too nice people call them ah like he or she is a goody two shoes or ah he or she is a teacher's pet like these are the thing that like you know uh, like in schools and stuff that kind of happen and the like you know the people who are neutral on this like who kind of act like this uh, but not too much not too less they're like the like okay people like that's how it happens and she like felt like you know like in this movie also like we kind of saw like the other girls calling her like ah oh, you're like you're like goody two shoes aren't you like uh, like that but that's not something you know which uh, is like what can i say like like everyone has this thing like you cannot blame anyone for this like people have their own way of expressing themselves people have their own way of kind of interacting with the environment and interacting with other people so yeah like people will be like this people are different some people act a bit too nice some people act a bit too you know like rudely and some people are kind of in the middle of it so like i cannot blame her for that like everyone does that you know like everyone has a mask that they wear in front of others like if you meet someone else for the first time you would definitely try to act nice with them because you do not know how that person is like how is his or her personality like how they are like would interact with you you know nothing about them and at the same time they also kind of wear a mask and like interact uh, nicely with you but if you spend a few times with them if you like talk with them have fun and you become good friends then you start to like you know like <clears throat> like open the mask start to like uh, take off the mask in front of them and you show your real self to them because you know that yeah this guy or this girl like she's cool with it so i can be myself in front of them so that's what happens that's how friendship happens you know like no one like becomes best friends in a single day that doesn't happen so yeah like okay I'm, I'm like going on a completely different direction but yeah like that was what i was trying to say so that thing happened and like she felt bad about it which i don't blame her for because like 
you know like she herself like the the thing that she's the, the guy the the kid said to her that like uh, she shook hands with everyone and then to her she said that i won't shake hands with you and like that kind of struck her and she thought that oh maybe she knew that i am secretly hating him and uh, like i acted like this like a goody two shoes in front of the others and she like he hated that and that's why she, he did not shake hands with me and she felt bad about that <clears throat> but in actuality i think that was also like that was not the main reason i think in actuality as uh, like uh, toshio uh, toshio was his name wasn't it yeah he said that like actually it was the uh, like reverse like it was like that he liked you that's why like, he he tried to act tough with you like you know like kids have this weird thing <clears throat> when they're like you know young that uh, like i'll act cool in front of the person that i want to impress and but like while doing that they make a fool out of themselves like that's like kids in a nutshell <laughs> and that's it's the same thing that happened here like uh, like there's also a ty other type of kids who like bully the person they like you know like and that's also another thing so like that's because they're kids and sometimes that bullying thing kind of goes too far which is quite bad like that's a completely different thing i'm not going to talk about that but like things like that happen you know like where uh, children kind of really get traumatized uh, but at the, like you know but the person who was bullying them was probably be bullying them because they like you know like wanted to get their attention but because they're kids they are unable to uh, you know like set any limits they kind of went too far and like that traumatized the person they were bullying or something like that's something completely different i'm not going to talk about that but yeah like the same thing is here like he tried to act tough in front of her that's why like uh, when it came to like shaking hands with her like he, like the first thing that she, he felt, must have felt was embarrassment like uh, about two things the first thing that he felt embarrassed about was like i am so dirty i'm so unclean i'm so unhygienic and like i'm embarrassed to shake hands with the person that i like that's the first thing and the second thing that she he was embarrassed about was obviously because he liked her that's why he was embarrassed these two things were the embarrassment factor working on him and another thing that was working on him was the like you know uh, urge to act cool in front of her that's why he was like ah i don't shake hands i'm too cool for that <laughs> you know <laughs> that was it like that was basically it and like she felt as if like oh maybe he was like he knew my uh, inner you know my inner feelings that's why he did not want to shake hands with me because like i've been so like you know like bad like uh, like you know i've been uh, like like my personality is like this that's why like he she thought about so many things and but the like guy was thinking about something completely different that's why he did not shake hands and like that's the same thing that happened like when they were in the like you know the marketplace and like the uh, the kid was like holding the hands of his dad and then when suddenly they like met eyes he like shook away their hands put his hands in the pockets and started spitting <laughs> yeah like the, according to him that's how people act cool and because like uh, like you know he came into contact with her in the marketplace uh, he was really not expecting that and he got like shook in that moment and like he realized that oh my god like i'm like holding my dad's hand like how embarrassing so like i'm too cool for that so he like left his dad's hand and put it in his pockets and started acting like a, like like you know like a thug or something which is cool in his eyes yeah that's what you know happened and yeah no one is at fault here it's just that they were kids that's it like you know like people do weird stuff while when they're kids people do even do weird stuff when they're adults so yeah <laughs> you know and that was kind of like eating at her which got resolved in the end and yeah and i'm sure like you know like uh, they'll eventually get married or something like toshu and uh, the girl i forgot her name but anyways uh, and yeah like that's how they implied it in the end you know like that with that uh that bamboo thing like that ai ai gasa uh, they call it ai ai gasa isn't it because like it's like ai ai means love love and gasa or means like umbrella 
Casa, like casa means umbrella, so it's like I I casa, <laughs> and it's like it's like uh like drawn like a like triangle like an umbrella with like two people's name underneath it, <laughs> which kind of like implies like you know when there is like raining and there's like one umbrella, people kind of get close to each other, and, like there's this whole thing like it's like an also an anime trope which we see you know like. Uh, sharing umbrellas <laughs> like in romantic comedies and stuff so yeah and <clears throat> yeah that kind of implies that they most probably got married in the end and yeah so that was it uh, this also shows like you know the people that you meet in your childhood in the schools and everything like eventually they like you know like you lose contact with them like it's extremely rare where like people keep contact with uh, their like like ch like extreme childhood friends who like you met in your school or something it's quite rare there are people like that but it's quite rare like you usually like lose contact with the people you met in school and everything like me as well like i and i when i was at school i thought that ah oh, like my friends like they are my everything i will like <coughs> keep contact with them forever until the day i die something like that but now like i barely have contact with them you know uh, i have contact with my like now like the friends that i have now and i'm sure i'll have contact with them for the rest of my life because you know like we are like kind of like grown up now but those school friends those school days they are kind of forgotten and yeah like it kind of shows like this show was a complete like nostalgic trip and I loved it because of that. Like it showed us a lot of things, and it was extremely relatable, at least for me, uh, in a few things. And yeah, it like in an entirety, this was a really nice like movie, and I enjoyed it. So that was it, guys. So this was uh, only yesterday or Omoide Poro Poro, and <clears throat> yeah, that was good. Like I like enjoyed it quite too much. And that's like a good way I'm going to end all of these Ghibli movies reaction because obviously like I do not have any other movie to react to any other Ghibli movie to react to this is the end I've done all of the others so like yeah so like you'll find all the reactions obviously in my playlist like Ghibli movie playlist so if you guys are interested in watching all the others I'm sure you guys have most of you guys have watched my other reactions as well so yeah so yeah guys thank you guys for watching and thank you really for you know like uh, supporting my this was like a thing that i thought that would not be as popular you know like people won't watch it because movies are a big thing like for two hours you'll have to sit and watch with someone else like uh like people usually do not have that time but still like i have to say like the response that i got from like reacting to these giving movies has been immense and by immense i mean it's immense like ghibli movies reaction is the biggest thing on my channel and i am extremely glad for all of you guys who have stuck around like watching the whole reaction with me and i am extremely like grateful for that because this like this thing has been quite big for my channel and i'm so glad about it like i think uh, like four or five movies have like i think two movies have gotten over 4k views which is immense for me and I think like uh, um, like three or five, uh, like three or four movies have got over 1K views. And like, yeah, like I'm extremely thankful for you guys for sticking around. And this has been the end, but I'll definitely continue the movie reactions every, you know, every week. And uh, next week I'm going to do Akira, which is I think another uh, like extremely popular movie. Obviously this is not a Ghibli movie. But I'm going to do it like this, you know, like I'm going to do all of the popular movies that I have not watched. <coughs> Excuse me, like for example, Akira and I think I'll uh, like the other movies, uh, for example, uh, what was that? I want to eat your pancreas, Suizo uh, Tabetai, that one uh, and a few others like I like I'll check it out like uh, anime movies I have barely watched in i have watched the few uh, popular ones for example uh koino katachi and your name and uh, what was that tenki no ko those those ones i've watched uh, the main main uh, like you know those uh, <coughs> extremely popular ones but other than that like anime movies i have barely watched any so like i'll definitely do all of the popular ones one by one and yeah i'm sure like 
you know like uh, like if you guys are interested be sure to tune in every week because like every day i'll do a new you know new movie and uh, if you guys have any suggestions which you want me to do you know like give a priority to definitely comment down below i'll definitely like try to do it as soon as possible because in the end i'm trying to do each and every anime movie which is popular so like eventually i'll definitely come to your movie but if you want me to do a particular movie before everything be sure to comment down below i'll try to do that you know i'll give it a priority so yeah so thank you guys for watching again uh, next week i'm doing akira so yeah be sure to uh you know like tune in and again i'm thanking you guys for supporting uh this for like uh, like so much and i'm like glad that i started this and like yeah like thank you that's all that i can say so thank you guys for watching this video also and if you guys enjoyed my reaction press the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed please consider doing so because that helps a lot in a lot of ways and comment down below your opinions anything you want to say anything you want to share i'll be sure to check them out and also be sure to like share uh, like what uh, anime movie you want to, me to do like you know give a priority to if you want so uh, like comment down below i'll like check them out so yeah guys thank you guys for watching again and i'll see you guys next week with another movie so until then goodbye and have a nice day